very proud of Carl. A Lagos State event that attracted comments at the 5th World Urban Forum in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. The session attempted to examine the possibility of mega cities serving as a bridge to the urban divide. This, incidentally, was the theme of this year's World Urban Forum. Why we are here basically is also to exchange experiences with other and share best practices so that we can continue to improve and consolidate on our achievement. And that is the essence of our past Over the world, uh, we believe that women are marginalized right? and children development is very, very low. And uh, if you must have a complete nation, a developed nation, women will be empowered financially. Morally, socially, psychologically, and emotionally, to be able to develop the children. And if children were well developed, are well developed, then the society will be benefit from it. You can see people asking questions, and we've been able to tell them that yes, participatory democratic process in urban governance has achieved, has made us to achieve so much in what we have done in Lagos. While the efforts of the Lagos State Government were appreciated, an improvement was recommended. There's much more that still needs to be done. There are many challenges. If you look at uh, the lifespan of the population, nutrition, opportunities, and if you look at um, maternal mortality, and child mortality, there's even more that can be done on the health programs. And the, the uh, presenters from Lagos made that point putting a lot more emphasis into healthcare systems. The coordinator of the Urban Forum says world leaders need to adopt proactive measures to tackle the challenges in the cities. There is, as you know, a continuous exclusionary process of the urban process. If the governments do not step in with remedial measures to make sure the poor don't get poorer or the rich don't get richer, and so on and so forth. These are some of the issues that have brought the world's leaders together for seeking for solutions of how we are going to continuously live in a, an urban world and make a success of it. Growing metropolitan centers will continue to attract the attention of world leaders who gather biannually to deliberate on the way forward. It's hoped that subsequent conferences would eventually chart a path to a better urban future. Vivian Irikefi, STV News.